Are you looking for some of the best programming languages for the year 2023? These days there are over hundreds of different programming languages but it is quite hard to pick the best ones among them. So in this video I will share the top 7 programming languages for the year 2023 that are also very beginners friendly and after learning them you can easily get into any field from web development and mobile development to machine learning and data science. These programming languages are highly in demand and can help you have a better career. So without wasting much more time let's get started. Number 1 on our list is Python. Python is one of the most popular programming language in the world due to its nice clean and very easy to use syntax. It is also considered to be the best programming language for beginners. Python is widely used in web development, machine learning, data science and AI. Python is also used by many popular tech companies like like YouTube, Quora, Pinterest and Instagram. In my opinion if you are a complete beginner then I highly recommend to go with Python. Number 2 on our list is JavaScript. JavaScript is used by more than half of the developers in the world right now. In the beginning JavaScript was built for client side web development but nowadays JavaScript is used for server side or in backend of applications as well. It can also be used to build high quality mobile applications using one of its framework called as React Native. JavaScript is used by more than 95% of the websites across the internet. Number 3 on our list is Golang. Golang also called as Go is one of the fastest growing programming languages these days because it is easy to use, multi-purpose and fast in speed. Go is created by Google in 2007. It is designed to build large scale applications, writing backend of applications, building cloud applications like Google Drive and Mega. It is statically typed programming language that is easy to use, very efficient and very structural programming language. Many big companies like Google, Uber, Twitch, Dropbox and many more uses Go as their primary programming language. Number 4 on our list is Kotlin. Kotlin is created by JetBrains and launched in 2016. It is similar to Java but consists of some more features. It is used to create Android applications. Kotlin is also considered the official language of Android therefore it is worth to learn Kotlin. I recommend if you want to enter into mobile app development then go with Kotlin. Number 5 on our list is Swift. Swift is an open source programming language that is used to create iOS applications. It was entered the market in 2014 and as we know that iOS is the future of mobile phones therefore learning Swift is worth in 2023. It is also very compatible with almost all of the Objective C features which is also a programming language to make iOS apps. But I recommend to go with Swift because it is the most popular and highly in demand. Most popular iOS apps that uses Swift are WordPress, Firefox, SoundCloud etc. Number 6 on our list is C Sharp. C Sharp is the object oriented programming language which is used to create games and softwares. Most popular game engines like Unity uses C Sharp to create 2D and 3D games. It is very similar to C++ in syntax and highly efficient and fast in speed. If you want to enter into game development or desktop application development then I highly recommend to go with C Sharp. Finally, Finally on number 7 we have Dart. Now I have kept Dart in this list because Dart is used by Flutter which is the emerging technology these days. With the help of Dart programming language that is used by Flutter you can create high quality and native applications for Android, iOS, web as well as for other devices. All just with a single code base. So learning Dart will be a better choice for you in 2023. So these were some of the most popular programming languages that you should learn in 2023. These programming languages have high demand in the industry and also these programming languages are not going anywhere in the future. So guys that's it for this video. I hope you find this video helpful. For more videos like this make sure to subscribe to my channel and also press the bell icon next to it. At last thanks a lot for watching and I will see you in the next time.